Hello, what's up guys? And good morning everybody. And nice to see you and welcome back to our regional polytechnic and Institute of Singapore. And today, in this today video lesson, um, I'm going to share with you all about iOS Arena or process. And uh, I also have some question to ask you uh, that I studied last week. Uh, last week we studied together it first about do you know if you know the end if you know please tell me last week we started to get it about foreign policy and levels of analysis and changing ambitions of uh, discipline you know okay my question is to ask you right now according to the old point uh what is foreign policy what is foreign policy it is a government policy you know it is a government's policy on dealing with all deal on dealing with sorry, other countries for example yeah uh, in matters relating to trade or defense that is called foreign policy and I also have some yeah uh, vocabularies to ask you more okay uh, take a look above about this yeah uh, bilateral yeah bilateral bilateral it mean you know involving two groups or countries three picky bilateral relationship yeah and uh, compel having you know having to do something because you are forced to or feel it is necessary but harm and uh, coalition yeah coalition coalition the joining together of different political parties or groups for a particular purpose usually for a limited time coalition and uh, motive or reason for doing something yeah, yep. and translational, translation, uh, translational. It means uh, involving several nations. And terrorism, threat of, yeah, or something, or the situation, you know, uh, violent action, for political purposes. Uh, critical, critical, uh, giving opinions or judgment on books, plays, films, etc. It means bicharana and one more meaning is of the greatest importance to the way things might happen. Some can. Thank you. And one more, the last. The last one is remarkable, unusual, special, and therefore surprising and worth mentioning. Cool, got some call. Thank you. Now move on to the new. The new ones. Okay, but in this new new one is only uh, relevant in the old points. Yeah, it 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 in the same point. Yes, but in the new paragraphs from this. So from now here. Uh, from the nineteen fifties, from the nineteen fifties onwards, you know onwards, uh, beginning at a parallel time or continuing after it, onward. That is called onward. More and more higher scholars in that world. In that world, is it in, in the past in that world, but in the, the present, it only uh, and in R, ah, yeah, in that world. In that world, uh, to try to do something, to try to do something, you know, uh, to specify the focus of their analysis more clearly from uh, 1950 onwards. Yeah, the most prominent, prominent, very well known and important. Like uh, why? The prominent example was uh, uh, Kenneth Wall's Man, uh, The State and War, a series called Analysis 1959, which introduced an analytical framework for the studies of IR that distinguished between what he referred to as different images of an issue the individual 
the state and the international system. Wall's contributions to the discipline generated interest in analyzing an international system as a place of interaction between states. Let's take a look at this generated. This generated, you know, uh, it, it, it verbs uh, generate uh, to cause something to exist. Generate. And uh, from uh, yeah, from this perspective, the global system is conceived of as the structure or contact uh, within uh, which state cooperate, compete, and confront each other over issue of national interest. Conceive to invent a plan, yeah, to invent a plan uh, or an idea. Do you mind visualize, visualize to follow pictures of someone or something in your mind in order to imagine or remember them? Do you mind visualize, you might visualize of it as a level above the state. Particularly uh, important in that context is the contribution of power among states, meaning whether uh, there is one main uh, concentration of power, concentration, uh, a close gathering of people or thing from more problem. Uh, 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 Juni, polarity, Juni polarity, it means uh, there is sole superpowers that is the dominant in the international system. Mohammed mean the that is called uh, yeah, a genie polarity. One way we can say that uh, of a main concentration of power. And about a second one is two, it mean uh, a bipolarity. Bipolarity I mean two superpower. Yeah. And uh, several multipolarity. Global circum circumstances are seen to, uh, or, you know, sorry, or seen to condition the ability and opportunity of individual states and groups of states to pursue their interests in cooperative or competitive ways. The views of state are being embedded, embedded, embed. You know, if an emotion, opinion, etc., is embedded in someone or something, it is very strong, or what is it important part of them? The job, the job, yeah. In a global context, traditionally, uh, comes with the assumption that our international system is anarchic. An anarchic system is one that lacks a uh, central government or international sovereign uh, that regulate and controls what happened to state when they are dealing with each other. And this is the, the old points that caught you last week. Yeah, they are in the same point. And uh, although uh, these ideas of the global and system are labels, they are a context of anarchy. Anarchy a situation in which there is no organization and control, especially in the study, uh, because uh, there is no effective effective government. Another but I features in many contribution to the IR literature. In the main focus, uh, remains on the state as the dominant unit of analysis. This enduring focus on the state endure yes in, in endure endure to suffer yeah to suffer something difficult, unpleasant, or painful. Also, this enduring uh, focus on the state and uh, therefore on the state level analysis is referred to as the relative state centrism or uh, the discipline. This means that uh, IR scholar would generally not only regard state as the central unit uh, of analysis such as uh, air side survey, uh, they also conceive 
perceived already yeah the import card of the state as a point of reference for other types of actors uh, from this perspective perspective of particular ways of considering uh, con considering uh, something does not be said. the state uh, acts as the arena arena is a large flat area surrounded by seat uh, used for sports or entertainment in in which state you know official politicians yeah and decision makers operate the state is seen as the framework that encapsulates encapsulate society in encapsulate encapsulate to express or show the most important fact about something but yet behind encapsulate uh, society and as the main point of reference for the individual this a predominant focus on the state is strongly related to an assumption Irish fellow have made about uh, the state also being the main location of power within the international sphere. Sphere, subject, or areas of knowledge, work, etc. We say, an assumption, the act of taking a position or a power responsibility. Castle uh, assumption. Uh, this idea uh, that the state is aware power is uh, primarily concentrate, concentrated and located has to be seen again yeah again uh, the historical contact within which some of the most prominent IR scholar operated the Cold War it was an error uh, it was an error in which minds of international affairs appeared uh, to be run via state channels and in line with particular state interest. Other actors uh, that we would consider important from today's perspectives, such as uh, those is flawed in later chapter in uh, this book, as seem to have very little leverage leverage power to influence people and get the result they want and appear leverage during the cold war this was because the period was dominated by great power confrontation and overwhelming overwhelmed very great and very large yeah overwhelming military uh look yeah of overwhelming military might on each side of the systemic con conflict uh, although although uh, the cold war has long since passed a lot of today's political life remain managed in the state framework based on issues like national security domestic uh, cohesion yeah cohesion cohesion mean the situation when the members of the group or the study are united Garu boom cohesion or internal stability stability state form the primary primary yeah state form the primary kind of actor in most of the major challenges of our time and states still hold the, uh, what famous German sociologist Max Weber uh, called the Potopoly. Potopoly, an organization or groups that has complete control of something, especially an idea of business, or so that others have no share. Potopoly on violence, the exclusive, exclusive limited not only one person or groups of people but like more exclusive right to be leg uh, legitimate yeah legitimate uh use of physical force state continue to matter and thus you know have to be part of our considerations about what happened in the world and why the state 
as a unit of uh, analysis and frame of reference will certainly not go away anytime soon nor will be will uh, sorry will uh, the interactions of state as a key level of analysis in ir let's move on in this new point that everybody is gotta learn to this new uh ir as editor or process ir ir is that for international relation as editor or process let take a look together it is important to find, yeah, to 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 highlight, sorry, to highlight uh, that thinking from the points of views of different, and to a uh, degree separate levels of analysis as uh, discussed up uh, to this point has been contested by some. Uh, last which uh, two thousand four for the stands has argued that thinking of international politics as something that take place in a certain site or location is just uh, one possible ways of looking at things. He called uh, this uh, the arena approach of uh, given the ways in which it focuses on the location or locus. Locus, the place where something happens or the central area of interest in something being discussed. Legal line, yeah of interactions on different uh, platforms platform uh, you know the rest uh, the rest a uh, part of the floors in a large room from which you make a speech or give a musical performance with the car that provide a stage uh, to particular event and instances instead a particular situation even affect especially an example yeah, an example of something that happened generally. Had kapat ka, your instance. Instances of international relations. Uh, but he distinguishes this arena approach from what he calls the processual. Processual relating to involve or involving uh, the uh, study of uh, processes rather than event. Dabnaka. Approach which assumes assume uh, uh, to accept something to be true without question or proof somewhat, that uh, international relations should not primarily uh, primarily uh, be looked at as uh, something that happened in a particular location or at a particular level of analysis uh, but that it is it can sorry but that uh, it can instead uh, be thought of a complex, uh, yeah, a complex uh, web of processes uh, that take place uh, between people. Some theoretical approaches have uh, what is often an implicit, 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 uh, complete, and without any doubt. Implicit uh, preference for a conception. Uh, conception, an idea of what something or someone is like, or a basic understanding of a situation or a principle, that's not, of IR as a process rather than an arena with uh, various distinctive labels. This is because they, uh, they aim to highlight the meaning of interactions as opposed to the meaning of physical structures and location, such as a state or particular institution within states. But examples of such a perspective can be found in environmentalism. Environmentalism, an interest in or the study of the environment in order to protect it from damage from by, sorry, by human activities, by titanium, or so-called just to show that the thing is so called, you, you just show that the thing, a word that is used to describe someone or something, is not suitable or uh, is not correct. Klein Klai, coffee cup, but just so called. Green politics. Green, why, why do we say green policy? Because a political, it's referred to, you know, uh, political uh, ideology uh, 
that aims to foster to foster an ecologically sustainable society often but uh, not always rooted in environmentalism yeah, environmentalism uh, nonviolence social justice and justice and uh, grassroots democracy that is called green politics uh, which traditionally uh, refuses to think of the practice of uh, international relations as something that can be studied at different levels of analysis. This is uh, mainly because analysts uh, pertaining, yeah, pertain, I mean, uh, to be connected with a particular subject, event, or situation, born, yeah, pertain. Analysts pertaining to this approach perceive to see something or someone or to notice something that is obvious, you're going to perceive any proposed division of political reality into arenas or any attempts at physically locating a problem in a particular context as uh, arbitrary. arbitrary using lim unlimited personal power without considering uh, other people's wishes. Yes, arbitrary and misleading. Mislead, misleading, you know, causing someone to uh, believe something that is not true. Misleading. Uh, they would also argue that thinking in those division conveys conveys you know convey to express a thought feeling or idea so that it is understood by other people behind the chair convey conveys a false sense of structure when all aspects of any social uh, societal yeah uh, societal a challenge uh, fundamentally, fundamentally, in a basic and important way. Jimultan, interconnectedness and uh, should thus uh, be studied in a holistic way, meaning in uh, conjunction with other, with each other. Holistic. Uh, holistic, I think, with or treating the whole of something or someone and not just apart a room holistic other example of such a theoretical approach is feminism feminism the beliefs that women should be allowed the same right power and opportunities as men and the yeah and be treated in the same way or the set or activity intended to active the state strategium yeah which would argue that politics does not ex exclusively occur in public places such as uh, state institution and international organizations. Feminist, feminist, a uh, feminist, sorry, feminist, a person who believe in uh, feminism, often use uh, being, sorry, often be involved, involved uh, in activities that are intended to active change I would instead uh, argue that uh, the personal is the political meaning uh, that all human interaction carry and broad produce political meaning and are therefore part of us intricate uh, the intricate intricate uh, uh, having a lot of small parts or details there are details uh, that are arranged in the complicated uh, ways and you know uh, and are therefore uh, sometimes difficult to understand solve or produce smoke spine some yam yeah of uh, the intricate uh, process of global affair other thinkers would even go as far as uh, to suggest uh, that politics as a process is not even confined, uh, be confined to its structure here, uh, be confined uh, to somewhere or something. I mean to exist only in a particular era, era, uh, area, sorry, 
or groups of people come not confined to the human species. Uh, Franz Delval, 1982, argues that even the interaction between animals such as chimpanzees, yeah, chimpanzees, I mean, uh, types of uh, monkey, yeah, a small, very intelligent uh, African ape uh, with a black and brown fur, yeah, uh, can carry political meaning and should thus uh, not be excluded from any intellectual accounts of politics including its international and global dimension of intellectual in relating to your ability to think and understanding things yeah especially complicated ideas panya is called panya that means panya and uh, global dimension it is concerned with uh, exploring uh, interconnection between people and places it asks us uh, to observe the similarity yeah similarities and uh, differences yeah differences uh, that exist in the world and relate uh, them to our own lives that is called global dimensions uh, we will not develop uh, these kinds of perspective further uh, at this point but it is nevertheless, nevertheless useful to note how such contentious, con contention, sorry, contention and opinion expressed in an argument, jumlo, challenge any assumption, already assumption is not, uh, of there uh, being any kinds of, uh, kind of clear cut fracture and specific levels of analysis that we ran, we can rely on uh, as student and analyst of IR, regardless of perspective. It is important to be aware of uh, the multipli uh, sorry, multiplicity, multiplicity, a large number or wide range of something. Jumbro, multi, multiplicity. Uh, of actor and processes that make up uh, the global system, reminding ourselves of the complexity of international relations equipped us with the ability to recognize any over generalization, Ge over generalization ways of thinking where you apply what one experience to all experiences, including. Or, you know, those in the future over generalizations as uh, they are being presented to us by the media, by political leaders, activists, pressure groups, and through, and through our social networks, making us more informed. Uh, yeah, and new ends. Yeah, we pronounce it new ends. New end. Uh, and around it in our thinking. New end, it means uh, uh, made slightly different in appearance, meaning sound, etc. Yeah. Thank you, everybody, for uh, yeah, uh, okay, listening to my video lesson and watching my video lesson today. And if you have the, the question, you can ask me uh, through our yeah, Telegram group. And uh, you can ask me in my yeah, private account. And don't forget to write down the, about the vocabulary because in this point, it has a lot of difficult for everybody to learn. It's really hard for you, I think. And I know that it's hard for everybody to study about this new one and in this new book. And uh, thank you. Goodbye. See you. Good luck.